Hey guys, so in this video, I want to show you how to do Etsy product keyword researching. It's something that's very important when you're starting out a new Etsy store or even someone that's been doing it for a while. You can, you definitely want to keep going back and revisiting the certain trends, the certain keywords and titles that might work for you. So I'll just really make sure that this video is nice and short so you get straight to the point. So in a lot of my previous videos, I've, I've talked about using keyword researching tools like eRank and Marmalade. Both are great in their own way, right? To brainstorm new ideas, to research different Etsy shops. But I want to show you another one that I've been using a lot lately. And this one is called Everbee. So for Everbee, it's another keyword researching tool, but they do something slightly different than eRank and Marmalade, which is they use a Chrome extension straight into the browser so that when you're on Etsy, you can quickly use their Chrome extension here. Okay. And I'll just go right into it and show you using an example. And by the way, you can use this for any category that you want to tap into. So whether you're doing digital products or physical products, this is a great way to just research into the category. So let's just jump right in. Let's do, let's try, let's try necklace as an example. And like I said, you can use this for right, any of your categories. So once you come in here, let's say you try to do necklaces, whether it's print on demand or physical, you see all the different listings within this page, right? So once you're on here, you go to extension for ever be, and you'll click on analytics. And I'm, I'm assuming like, I'm not going to show you exactly how to download this because, or maybe I can make another video on that, but I'll have it in the link below if you want to check out ever be and just download it for your Chrome browser. But anyways, you would click on analytics and right now it's loading all the different listings that you had on your previous page, which is like this one here, because it's linked to it, right? So it just takes a little bit of time and it'll give you all the data, like the shop name, product name, the pricing favorites, right? All these things. And, but the most important part I want to talk about is the estimated monthly uh, revenue here. I kind of like to just mark it by the most, like the highest amount, kind of filter it that way. We get to see exactly like how much they will estimate it, but like pretty much how much they make within a month. And so this will give you a good idea of what you want to try creating, it'll give you a good idea of what's trending, right? And that's the whole idea of just product researching, keyword researching. You want to know exactly what your competitors are doing. What, what are their best sellers? You can always click right into their shop name from here, which is perfect. You click on the shop name and you can do this whole analytics right from the shop. You can see like pretty much any shop, what they're doing in terms of the numbers estimated. Let's click on this one, $4,000 a month on one listing. That's pretty cool. Just a circle necklace. Like it looks really cool. You can see all their, you can go back and check out all their tags, how long they've been around. I mean, five years, they, they've been, they've been around for a long time. So it might be kind of tough to kind of compete in this one, but there's definitely other categories I can show you how you can tap in using this keyword researching. Let's see. Let's do, you know, I think a lot of people are in printable wall art. So let's do printable wall art. I promise I'll try to keep these videos short. And also, you know, if you're liking this, this video so far, you know, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, my channel, we just kind of go over anything that's like Etsy based selling online, e-commerce and, and stuff like that. So yeah, please like, and subscribe if you haven't. And also, yeah. So I clicked on the page here and I went to same thing, go to analytics and uh, here we go. You can see all the different listings from there. I like to sort it by monthly revenue. Okay, cool. Pink wall collage prints. Okay, let's click onto it. $500 a month from that one single listing. Very crazy, very cool. And now you know, okay, whoa, wow. Maybe I haven't, maybe you haven't noticed this niche. Maybe you don't know about it, but you know, keyword researching, right? Using Everbee. Now you can find out if this is something that you want to try exploring, right? And create a shop based around it. Cause I know a lot of people actually created collage decor sites. And I haven't really talked about the, this category no, ever actually, but it's something I looked into and people are actually making a lot of money. So now you can get more niche. Maybe you want to use some of these keywords, collage prints and put that in here and then research from there. All right. And you can get really deep using ever be and just keep exploring new ones. But that's kind of the base, the idea that I like to use this for I mean, There's other features on here and they're always, I think they're growing a lot more, but just this feature alone is something that e rank and Marmalade doesn't really offer. And so that's why I find this really valuable. And, and yeah, like I said, look at the tags, 
you can see how long they've been up for. Right, this one's only been up for nine months, and they're already doing like almost 800 USD a month from one listing. Right, so you can keep looking and and see what else they do. And for example, right, you can if you think this shop is cool, you can click on a shop and you can go and do the same thing here. You can do you can you can track the data for every single one of the listings. But you know, my guess is that that one is probably their best seller. And by the way, I think they you can use a free plan. They have the more expensive one, but that one you can just do more searches. I think the free one you can only do 10 keyword like you can always press this 10 times in a month. So I think it's very affordable. You can just try it out and do all your researching just for initially so you can get a good idea and then you don't have to stick around, right? But highly recommend it. But yeah, so that one's definitely the best one. But even then, like it's pretty sweet, right? And obviously I'm just randomly <laughs> clicking on these. I haven't really looked at them, but just giving you an example of what you can use ever be to do your market research. And I promise I'll keep this short. I was gonna, <laughs> I want to show you maybe another category, but I think you pretty much got the idea on what you can do here. So yeah, let me know if it's, if you've used this before, if you're planning on using it, but I recommend checking it out. It's just another tool kit that I've been using other than E-Rank and Marmalade, which all serve their own purpose, but this is something that, you know, they haven't really, they can't really do. And this is such an efficient way to track everything and make you think, oh, maybe I want to try a different niche. Maybe I want to explore certain tags, see how, how long these listings have been up, right? So yeah, take a look to it have a link below and let me know if you have any questions like and follow and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in the next video take care bye